I'd like to demonstrate for you how to export. So first, what you're looking at is I have created this video. Here it is here, and it's ready to go. I like everything that we've done. It's 42 seconds long, and I would like to put this up into uh, a place that students can see it, like YouTube. So in the upper right-hand corner, you see the export button. If I click on it, I want to export, of course, as a video. A number of options appear here, um, and the ones that I like the most are uh, YouTube is a great one, obviously. Photos, I use a bunch. That just puts it in your photo category on this iPad or on your, on your item uh, to later upload. Uh, but it would save it on a, on, a de on a desktop or those kind of things. And then I also sometimes use your Google Drive. Now, for me, the best technique is to go straight to YouTube. The reason I like that is because um, the work is already, already being done. Now, they create kind of a blank information spot for you. Um, this stuff can all be changed when you get into YouTube. But let's just give it a name that I recognize when I get it in there. Um, I don't need to leave the project was created by explain everything, but I'll leave it for now. Uh, it is educational, it is public, and then I hit publish. Now, the first time you do this, um, it will require you to log into your Google account so that it connects to your YouTube channel, and um, which is awesome because once that connection is made, um, when you do this, just as I'm doing, it then starts the preparing or the rendering process, and then it moves to the uploading. So I'm just going to pause for a second while this is ticking, and then we'll see what happens at the end. When it's done uploading, it will simply just tell you that, that there was success, and then you click uh, OK, and you are able to then just exit your product, project and um, start um, you know, start a new one if you would like and, and move move from there. So the thing I didn't show you here is two things. One, the next thing you could do is go to YouTube and then begin to like uh, adjust that title and those things. The other thing is sometimes that upload link for me doesn't work. And when it doesn't work, actually, and I'll do this on another video in a minute, but I'll add it to this one as well, is one way to do that is to save as a, oops, I hit the wrong thing there. Let's try that again. Is to save as uh, in the photos area. And what that does is it just simply puts it on your tablet. And then what I do is I go into the YouTube app and I upload from my photos. So it's a backup plan to uh, if the direct link doesn't work. But I'll create a video for this one too.